Hello everybody, uh, how are you today? I wish you are staying healthy. Yes, all right. Uh, at this time, I would like to present about the define of teaching classroom management. So uh, as the teacher, classroom management is one of the important the way where uh, we teach because uh, we have to, to our purpose uh, in teaching English so it will be better and then how to make the students have a good motivation when they learn uh, with me okay so uh, what's that uh, define teaching and classroom management okay on the most basic level, classroom management is any technique that teachers use to facilitate the instruction and make sure that students learning most effectively in smooth classroom management. Then having structure uh, was that the, the system of which uh, expectation are set for the student behavior in the classroom can help uh, to minute the class environment most effectively, ensuring uh, that students are being held accountable uh, for their action and behavior. So how uh, create for the classroom management is depend on the environment. There are many character and characterization, and they are very different. So, it is uh, very difficult for some teacher in guiding when they give uh, was that when the learning process is doing. And then is that uh, the classroom management can uh, differ depending on what the subject. Age growth or teaching tools are being used. Yeah, okay. Uh, it means from the age means different. From the character and characterization is different, and then the material is different. So, how to teach them? As the teacher, have was that a strategy, method, or a rule? That means it's very different between uh, an age or an class. Each classes, I mean. And then uh, the next means classroom uh, management. For uh, instance, uh, testing to manage an art, a class will look vastly different than those used to manage a computer class. Okay. In art class, subjects are used to was that uh, the students are responsible for cleaning and property and taking care. The expectation with the noise level in this class will also look different from that uh, of the computer class, where the students are expected to be focused on their device and the lesson at hand. So uh, maybe if you are a classroom teacher or was that a subject teacher, so I think there are many kind of types and that can be defined depend on your subject. Uh, if I teach math, so it is uh, need different method, and then. When I teach an art, so how to make the student can be enjoying so they can was that they can take uh, and conclude or inspire that can be write down on their own uh, paper. So it's very different. Okay. And then the regardless uh, of the way uh, you are an art. Or a computer teacher, are there anything in between? Okay, having a plan, yes, of course. 
what kind of the plan plan means uh, like a lesson plan all the teacher have to uh, manage their classroom by was that preparing a uh, lesson plan for classroom management it's extremely important one of the goals as a teacher is depend on uh, was that uh, lesson plan the goal uh, for all the teacher is have an organized a productive and safe environment for student in their classroom having a definition and expectation of your classroom management system is especially important at the beginning of the semester maybe before uh, before we teach in each semester so we can uh, create our lesson plan okay there are kind of the program what kind of the purpose that one uh, teacher do and then this allow you to set those expectation for the students on the first day and then uh, of the class so that uh, we was that when it is time to reward or requirements and action during the semester students no expectation they did or they don't need i think uh, lesson plan have to give not only for the teacher but uh, for the students too and then because why i believe from the lesson plan uh, student can prepare well what kind uh, what will they do okay in this semester so i think that's all this define of the classroom management. See you.